Luke, what, um, what do you hope to see in game two, improvement-wise, from, from your first preseason game? Improvement. That's, well, you said it. We, we just want to continue to get better. All right, so we had, you know, a certain amount of possessions that we liked uh, the first game. We want to see more of those. We had a couple really nice uh, fast breaks off of their made baskets where we took it out quick, got the ball up, up the court with, a, you know, a couple passes. Uh, we want to continue to do that. Defensively, we got to play aggressive without fouling. We fouled way too much. Um, you know, defensively, our switching, we weren't coming together as much as we want to. So the, all the little things that we work on every day, we want to just we just want to continue to see a little bit of improvement each day. How much will LeBron play tonight? Because you know, people at Staples Center, his first time there, they want to see a lot of. Him. Yeah, um, he's. They, they they won't they'll see a lot of them. He'll be in the building. Um, <laughs> but as far as on the court, you know, we'll get him out there again uh, to start the game, and then we'll, we'll we'll take it from there. Between 15 and 48 minutes this time. I'll go between two and 48. Okay. He'll play more than he'll play more than one. Making some progress. Yes, yeah, progress uh, a little bit each and every day. He, he mentioned the, the points of emphasis for the fouling. Have, have you talked about that a lot with the team since the game the other night? Uh, we've talked about it. I wouldn't say we've, we've talked about it a lot. We know, um, you know, what they're looking for, and we know what we need to do. But we have uh, other uh, other things we're spending more time on than that. But we just, you know, that's what they're calling. You watch the other preseason games; they they called it like that all all across the league. So uh, we just got to do a better job of, of showing our hands. What do you think is going to be the toughest of those points of emphasis for players to adjust to? The the freedom of, of movement. Um, you know, like I said, the rule hasn't changed. They're just calling it more. So it, it's like anything. It's habits. Everyone in the league does this. Not everyone. A lot of big players in the league just naturally do it. Uh, whether it's a, a hand on a hip or, you know, we've taught for years if somebody's cut, coming off a pick, get in front of them. You know, chest them, take them off their line. Um, so these are all ha uh, habits that are, are going to have to be broken and retaught again. If you look back to a year ago, you had two pretty good rebounders, Nance and Randall, who are no longer with the team. How do you account for that? There was a rebound disparity the other night. As a team, there was a lot, you know, to, it started with there was a lot of 50 50 balls we didn't get to. And to me, if we're going to be a good rebounding team, uh, you know, we're going to have to be a good 50 50 ball team too, because we're smaller. Uh, we're going to have smaller lineups out there, so it's going to be guys going after balls, aggressively searching out rebounds and loose balls. Uh, and we didn't do a great job with that the first night. But to re you know to make up for those two that you named, it's a team effort. I mean, those are two big, strong, physical, athletic players. Um, so it's a team effort to make up for those. Will you keep the starters the same tonight? No, we're going to start Josh Hart tonight uh, and bring KCP with the second unit. Just get a couple different looks. Again. What, are you, what are you curious to see from Josh? What are you curious to see from KCP? Is there uh, just both. Yeah, you know, we're looking for the same things. Just, um, you know, I've to talked to, to KCP and everything he's done all training camp is perfect. It's exactly what we asked him to do. You know, he's running, he's playing defense, he's shooting when he's open. So keep doing that. Uh, just do it with the second group. Because no matter who we end up starting, uh, you know, they're going to be playing with different groups throughout the game. So we need to stay. We can't just be one group and another group for now. We got to keep getting guys uh, comfortable with playing uh, with each other. Luke, you have a very unique perspective as a man who played against LeBron and now coaching him. In this short coaching window, how would you describe what you've learned that maybe you didn't know playing against him? Uh, I've always heard how, what his basketball IQ was like, but in the short time I've spent with him, it's it's off the charts. I mean, it's uh, it's really impressive what a, a student of the game is and he is, and, and the way he sees the game and uh, can communicate that to uh, to his teammates is, is is very impressive. Is that is that is that even more evident during a game? No, that's that's one of the things that's so impressive about it is he does it in shoot around. We're doing five on O today, and he's as I'm calling out the plays and the actions I want out of those plays. Uh, he you know he sees where it's going and he starts calling it out at the same time. I have the sheet in front of me. He hasn't seen the sheet yet, so it, you know that's you know it, it's something he's doing all the time. Anytime he's in the gym, he's doing it. Um, so uh, yeah. 
Luke, does Javel have any minutes restrictions on him based on the asthmatic condition that he has? No, no. But you know, we're, we want to play fast, so I expect Javel to get tired. Uh, if he if he looks over at me and needs a sub, that means we're, he's he's playing the right way. You, you want to play fast, but the fast break points were not in your favor that night. What, what do you think that is? Uh, our defense was not good. Yeah. Um, we didn't rebound the ball well. To, to be a really good fast break team, we got to get 50-50 balls. You got to rebound the, the basketball. Um, we didn't do that, and uh, you know, that, so that 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 part of it, the overall number wasn't good but there was some really good possessions within the game that we had as far as the way we were pushing the ball um, that I was impressed with for you know being game one.